My name is Ruben and today we're talking about shock choice for the Madonna. We work closely together with Fox and have custom tunes for the DPX2, FloatX2 and DHX2. The first two being air options and the DHX2 being a coil option. Now, generally speaking, an air shock has the advantage that you can make small changes by releasing a little bit of air or adding a little bit of air. But you also have a great tool in using volume spaces which changes the progression of the shock. This is maybe something that you won't use after one or two rides, but it is a great tool once you get to know your bike very well. The main advantage of the coil option, the DHX2, is that the small bump sensitivity combined with the ball bearings on both shock ends are on a different level. On the air side of the shocks, we've got two options, the DPX2 and the Float X2. Now, I wouldn't say that the Float X2 is like the bigger brother of the DPX2. I would say that both shocks are both great shocks. The main difference is that the Float X2 offers four different damping adjustments and the DPX2 is a little simpler in the way you set it up. So the question which shock is better for you depends more on how much adjustment you want. The DPX2 is definitely easier to set up and is a great fit in the Madonna. But if you like to have high speed and low speed compression and rebound, then the Float X2 is the option for you. For all three shock options, we've got a base setting on our website where you can also find a video on how to set up your suspension. And if you then still have questions or if you own your Madonna for a while and there is something you want to change about your suspension, feel free to send us a message.